Welcome folks, this is Mando Farmer, and I'm bringing you a tutorial on this thing. The Cron Big M3 or 450, pardon me. Um, I have, you notice I have two versions out here, because there are two versions available in the game. Um, this is something that I searched for high and low myself, um, and was unable to find. Thus, I am doing the tutorial. I'm going to go over to this one only because this is the one I prefer and I kind of have it set up for this little tutorial anyways. Um, pardon me. Go around. Get in this thing. We will uh, go from there. So, what I'm bringing you is info on this. So here, let me show you where it is. So first off, it's in your purchase menu. Under mowers, this is a base game, the Big M450. The Big M450 with PTO is the mod you have to add. I believe I got it from the mod hub. This is the one I use. Um, I like it because of the PTO, plus it has more options. You can upgrade your engine and so on and so forth. Um, as well as your tires, you can do more adjustment with your tires. And, you know, that's always fun. So, here's what we have. We have the Big Crom. It cuts really well, as you can see. This is the cut it leaves behind. Um, but it's not in a nice central swath like I've seen a lot of other people do. I could not, for the life of me, figure it out. It took me forever. I finally figured out that this wording right here is the key. Select work mode. Well, to be able to do that, I had to go in here, to your key bindings, down here. This is in your regular menu and it was right here underneath vehicle work down here on the bottom it says work mode middle left or right and as you can see you can switch them with the shift or left shift and then an associated button so i u or o i don't know how to get it back to the main one that you see in the beginning um it may just be the comma button there to bring it back to kind of center but this is what will happen when you change those so let me get us up above this a little bit better so you can only do this when your machine is unfolded it does not have to be lowered or started but it does have to be unfolded um but i'm going to start it and this is how it looks when you start now i'm going to shift it to We'll start on the right, so we'll go O, and it's kind of weird because it's backwards from what you would think, but it it omits the swath on the right-hand side and puts it all to the left. And then you can switch that again to what they say is left. It does the opposite and omits the section on the left leaves the section on the right and then you can do i which is my personal favorite and then it puts it in the center and obviously you can change those key bindings to whatever you want but then it makes it very easy to haul a um forge wagon like i'm doing here or if you're using the ultimate bailing and mowing package you can hook those things all together and you can string out a crazy string of things um, whatever you should choose, but that's kind of that for this t tutorial. Um, I hope you guys found that somewhat helpful. And uh, if you did, go ahead and give me a like. And if you like what you're seeing, go ahead and subscribe and hit the subscription button or the uh, notification button, and it'll let you know as I make new and interesting content. Thanks again for watching. You guys have a wonderful day. This was Mando Farmer.